think. So you want okay. to stay on 50 milligrams and make sure it's the picolinate form. And then mm-hmm. uh, you, use your zinc and your vitamin A with fatty foods, with your EFAs, with your GLA, and with digestive enzymes. And then also you'd be very smart to throw in the Biolumin Nightly Essence Probiotics, taking three in the morning and three at night. And then last okay. but most certainly not least is 400 international units of, of vitamin E a day. Look for the mixed to cofferol form of vitamin E. And actually mixed now that I think mix to cofferol. And now that I think about it, uh, throw in some selenium, uh, ultimate selenium, which has some very important estrogen balancing effects. Uh, 200 okay. to 400 micrograms of that a day. Will you call me back or send me an email? Let me know how you're doing. Uh, absolutely. I'd love, it, yeah, call us back on the program. Or uh, Actually, I'd prefer that everybody could hear how you're doing. So give us a call back, Stephanie. Thanks so much for calling from Tampa, Florida. Appreciate it. Okay, let's see. Uh, go to Steve in Virginia. What's up, buddy? Welcome to the Bright Side. Yes, hello. Uh, thank you. It's always good to speak with you. Hey, we uh, had a, have a friend we... Um, uh, see occasionally in the uh, one of the stores, and uh, she was uh, apparently having gallbladder problems, and uh, she actually studied medicine in another country uh, several years. And uh, but she seems to be more aware of things. And we were, I know it can get you upset, but we were actually laughing when when we <laughs> the, the, the doctor told her, "Oh, let's just cut it out. You don't need it." <laughs> You know, That's what the doctor yeah, said. And it, we were laughing about it, but, I mean, it's really not, not funny. It's, but It's not hysterically funny, but it's ironically funny, yes. It, the, doc, yeah. the, the doctor and, tells uh, him. But we, we, we told her we would, we would check with you and see maybe maybe some, some things that she sure. could try. Uh, Absolutely. Gallbladder is very important. Uh, 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 there's a very important connection between fats and the gallbladder and foods in the gallbladder. The gallbladder is a digestive organ. If you've got gallbladder problems, you've got a digestive problem. If you've got a digestive problem, you've got a food problem. And that's easy because we're in control of food. Nobody's sticking food in our, in our blood and down our throats. It's our choice. So focus on fatty foods, number one. Uh, actually, even more importantly, link the gallbladder pain to specific foods and then eliminate those foods, and you'll find that most of the time those foods are fatty. Use lecithin, L-E-C-I-T-H-I-N. I know you know what that is, Steve, but for listeners, anytime you have a gallbladder problem, you want to start using lecithin. Uh, I like the granules. You can mix them up in a smoothie, or you can actually just put them in water and drink it down. It doesn't really dissolve in water, but you can drink it down in water. And then uh, use the ultimate enzymes, which have bile salts in those after all meals. Everybody should be using the ultimate enzymes after all meals, but especially if you have a gallbladder problem. And then we don't talk about this anywhere near enough on this program, or I don't hear anybody talking about this enough, but there's a very important connection between fat malabsorption and good bacteria in the gut. So uh, anytime you have a gallbladder problem or a liver problem or any other fat malabsorption issues, get yourself on probiotics, good bacteria. We're going to be talking about them for wound healing, probiotics for wound healing next week. Uh, But they're vitally, vitally important for all digestive issues, including fat malabsorption. And you can consider a gallbladder problem to be a fat malabsorption problem. So make sure uh, that you're on the Biolumin Nightly Essence, my favorite probiotic supplement. Three in the morning, three at night. You might also want to turn your friend on to the uh, Jordan Rubin's wonderful probiotic products, the Swero V and the Amasai, and also the probiotic enriched cheese. And then a couple other miscellaneous nutrients for helping with the bile system. Taurine, T-A-U-R-I-N-E, the amino acid that we talk about for wound healing and anti-aging is also important as a component of bile. And so is choline, C-H-O-L-I-N-E. Choline is also important as a uh, component of bile. Using stuff. Stomach bitters, uh, or sorry, Swedish bitters, which can help secrete, uh, help stimulate the secretion of bile before meals, especially before fatty meals, can have a nice beneficial effect for the gallbladder. Uh, you can also use bitter uh, vegetables like parsley or kale at the beginning of your meal, and that will also stimulate some digestive juices. It'll stimulate bile and digestive acids as well. So I've got lots of great strategies. Nobody ever should have a gallbladder taken out unless there's cancer in there. Certainly having gallbladder pain and having stones is not a reason to remove a gallbladder. And any medical professional who tells you that needs to go back and read the Hippocratic Oath, which says, do no harm. Taking out a gallbladder is a classic example of doing harm. So if a medical doctor tells you, oh, we can just yank that thing out, you don't need it, find yourself another doctor and and maybe give the guy a copy of the Hippocratic Oath, ask him to do some homework on it. Thanks so much, Steve. Hope I helped you. Any other, anything else going on? Is that good? Oh, and thank you very much. Uh, All right, we buddy. did mention a couple of the things to the lady, and uh, but uh, this will this will be very helpful. We really appreciate it. Good deal. God bless you, my friend. Take care. Okay, okay uh, Mark in New Hampshire. Welcome to the bright side. Got about a minute left for you. Greetings, Ben. I have a question and a, a testimonial for oh, you. Oh, good. Let's do the testimonial first. 
Well, uh, about two weeks ago, I blew something out in my lower back. It's a uh, pain I've never felt before, and uh, can't. I didn't think it was muscle or or uh, or joint issue, so it had to be a herniated disc. And I threw everything at it, longevity and non-longevity. And about two days ago, I remembered you said use the digestive enzymes, the ultimate enzymes, between meals or on an empty stomach. Yeah. Uh, the pain went from a nine to a two, and now today it's about a one. Praise God. Isn't that cool? How do you like I, that? I, I'm baffled. I mean, the <laughs> CM capsules, the, the CM cream, uh, curcumin, turmeric, uh, everything I threw at it. I don't take Tylenol or, you know, aspirin, so I, I emptied out my arsenal of stuff, and the, the ultimate enzymes uh, were the magic. Trick. That's amazing. And also, for, not just for you, Mark, but anybody out there, if you're having surgery, get on those ultimate enzymes, load up on those ultimate enzymes pre-surgery, and you'll, uh, you'll speed up the healing process. Real quick, what's your question, buddy? We're uh, running out of time. I applied some ointment to a person's ankles yesterday, and I, uh, one of the legs uh, started to feel really warm about an hour later, and I'm wondering, is that an allergic reaction Not or a fever? Just, did you say essential oils? No, uh, it's just some sort of uh, moisturizing ointment, over-the-counter type antiseptic. Uh, that could have been an allergic reaction. I need a little bit more information. Can you call back on Monday? Because we're out of time. I'd, I'd like to get some more information. Thank you so much for your call, and thanks for sharing that. That's really helpful information. Ultimate enzymes, between meals, great for inflammation, pa inflammatory pain, dental pain, sinus pain. This is, the, this is the power of nutritional supplementation. This is what we talk about every day on the Bright Side. Thank you so much, friends, for listening. I'm Pharmacist Ben. Have yourselves a wonderful, awesome, spectacular beautiful day. We'll talk to y'all later, folks. Bye for now. I didn't believe it. Neither did I. No way could you professionally remove unwanted hair, pain-free, and at home. My thoughts exactly. Remove my face and body hair without expensive, painful office visits. Not possible. Great minds think alike. Until I tried No-No Pro. Mm -hmm. Wait, you tried No-No? Yes, and it works. I use it on my face, legs, bikini line. We're BFFs, and you didn't tell me about No-No? Here, this is my new No-No Pro. The most powerful No-No made. Custom treatment levels, less hair in less time, perfect for any skin type. Try it. No hair, no pain, no time-consuming expensive office visits? No. No. And no. No, no. For a limited time, you could try No-No Pro risk-free. You'll also get the facial kit and a travel case. Get weeks of long-lasting results. That's it. I'm getting a No-No. Great minds do think alike. <laughs> try No-No Pro risk-free by calling 800-952-5760. 800-952-5760. That's 800-952-5760. 800-952-5760. Hi, this is Ted Anderson. Have you ever wondered why banks, stockbrokers, investment advisors won't talk about gold IRAs? They've been available since 1986, yet the financial industry won't recognize the value of gold for your retirement. Gold has outperformed paper investments, yet no word about IRAs. If you would like to have gold for your retirement, call 800-686-2237. Don't get left behind by rising inflation and low returns. Call 800-686-2237. Secure your future and call one 800 686 This is Ted Anderson. Have you ever wondered why banks, stockbrokers, investment advisors won't talk about gold IRAs? They've been available since 1986, yet the financial industry won't recognize the value of gold for your retirement. Gold has outperformed paper investments, yet no word about IRAs. If you would like to have gold for your retirement, call 800-686-2237. Don't get left behind by rising inflation.